there guys, it's Braxton20 with another episode of Braxton Plays. Today I'm going to be playing an awesome game that got greenlit on Steam called, <clears throat> called Unepic Demo. Unepic is just the demo because it's in its uh, beta form so far. And when it's released, I believe this game's going to be really amazing. Uh, it kind of has a feel of an old, a really old style RPG. It's just a side scroller, it's pixelated. But it looks really cool, even though it's an older style. Uh, and it has an older style of gameplay, and it's just a lot of fun. So let's just jump right in. I'm gonna create a new game. Uh, and we'll just go with Brax 20. Oh. I'll just go with Braxton then. And media. And I won't talk. I'll. Uh, I'll let you watch this little intro. It's pretty funny, actually. I love my open bow and shoot. Hang on, you're really shooting an arrow at a monster that can't bleed. What do you think will happen? That the arrow will get stuck between its rib cage and slow it down? Hey, it works in Legend of Zelda. <laughs> More on the best RPGs let you use common sense. Come on, step aside and let a cleric work. I take my holy symbol and I turn the undead. Get back to the pit from whence you came, you creatures. Roll d20. A blinding light appears inside their skulls. Both skeletons scream and their inert bones fall to the ground. <laughs> take that. Two skeletons in one shot. God, I'm good. Okay, then I approach quickly to see if they carry any loot. As you approach them, you step on a loose tile. You hear a click and a spear springs up just under your feet. Fuck a trap! I get a saving throw, right? Eric, pass me the chips. Hey guys, I got. Let's take a break. I have to pee. Again, fucking beer. End of the hall, left door. Light switches outside. Hang on, I'll be back in a minute. Bastards, you switched off the light! I'm peeing in here. Okay, you asked for it. But I can't aim in the dark. Fuck, I can't see anything. What the hell? Where's the toilet? I don't get it. I was just peeing in it. Oops, I think I pissed on the floor. Let's see if I can find the door. Nope, this is a wall. Wow, this wall's rough. I'd swear that I had wallpaper on it before. Nothing, I can't find the door. And this is definitely not the bathroom. I've got a bad feeling about this. I better light my Zippo. At least I'll have something. Find the Zippo in your inventory. Once you find it, select the equipped option to open and close the inventory. Press the I key. I have it set to Q. And then I click it. Equip. And voila, I have the light. What's this? Stone walls, columns, darkness? What the hell am I? Of course, those bastards must have put some sort of psychiatric, psychotropic shit in my beer. I'm having an hallucination. Cool, it almost looks real. Because that's the exact reaction you should have. Oh, what's this? There's something ahead. It looks like, holy shit, is that a skeleton? I'm imagining things. Maybe it's Ricky's granny taking a nap. I couldn't see her as a skeleton. Maybe it's Chester Copperpot. Does he have a key? Can't hurt to check. Whoa. Look, this place is crowded with traps. Which is actually a really cool aspect of the game. I don't know if you can see this due to the fact that it's only about pixel wide. But there is a small little platform deal right here. That if I step on the spice trap spring oh wow i never noticed the blood on the wall there either that looks cool oh i get it the hallway of the skeleton in the trap i'm imagining myself in an rpg that i must be in a dungeon or castle that my subconscious has created okay well the drug's working i get to be the player of my own rpg cool i'll complete it against myself even if i've never seen a dungeon master yeah whatever shit they probably put in my beer is really amazing I better draw a map so I don't get lost. And you get to open your map, and you can select it, and you can actually type in it, which is awesome. So I'm gonna put start. And then I can just go back, go up this ladder. And before you start playing, I want to mention something that uh, I'll look around while I do. Uh, the hotkeys that are binded for this are a little weird at the very beginning. Uh, like I'm, and when I say that, I mean it doesn't use WASD like most games do. It uses the arrow keys and then all the hotkeys for 
uh, inventory and everything is in the main keyboard. And it's just kind of weird. So I rebinded most of everything. And now I'm going to stop talking. Looks like we have a guest. And he is unarmed. Er, no, 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 no. I was just leaving. Of course not. Let me offer you my hospitality. Uh, hey, I don't want to be a bother, okay? Fear not, it will be no trouble to possess your soul and make you an eternal inhabitant of this castle. What? No! <sighs> Shit, that was scary. That shadow thing pounced at me. Wait a minute, where did it go? This is not possible. There is no faith in this soul. I cannot control this body. I hear that voice inside my... Holy shit, I've been possessed. Damn it. I can't escape. I am trapped within this body. In this prison of flesh. I'm possessed. I'm possessed. Why the hell do you go around possessing people, huh? When I possess a soul, I gain control of its body and I can do whatever it pleases me. Yeah, but it didn't work with me, did it, you some bitch? Ha, <laughs> fuck you, stupid creature. I just have to wait patiently for your death. Then I will be free again. In this place, it won't take long. Yeah, whatever. In a couple of hours, the drug will wear off anyways. So you don't scare me. I'm kind of a badass, considering. Actually, no, I'm kind of a pussy. I just talk big. <laughs> I love this character. Look at these corpses. In days of yore, they were creatures who dared to enter this castle. Now their bones are testament to their bravery. Yours will join them soon. Cool. So let's just keep walking. My Zippo lighter. I don't think that's how much a Zippo really lights up, but... Hey, a sword! Finally! It must belong to have belonged to this corpse. Hey, Dark Smoke Guy, you're lucky, you know. If I had this sword before, I could have split you into pieces. <laughs> don't make me laugh, mortal. If thou weren't so stupid, thou would know that I have no body and no weapon can harm me. But in World of Warcraft, I killed hundreds of ghosts with the sword. A world where shadows and spirits can be hurt by ordinary weapons. Not only are you stupid, but you're also a liar. Er, shut up. I'm taking my sword anyways. Go over and press enter on it. Then, go to F2. Wah! 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 And you can actually, uh, rebind the attacking to not use your mouse. I just have it set to that. So, I think that'll just be easier for me instead of having to have an attack button, too. Go in. Boom! Looks like it. Oh, look at all this loot. I'm rich. Gold is, what, nearly two grand when lambs? With just one of these coins, I could buy a PS3. Jeez, I'm an idiot. It's all hallucination, damn it. It's like when you dream that you are in the lottery and wake up with nothing. Take some coins. You could buy powerful artifacts and deadly weapons. Yeah. Wait a minute. You're waiting for me to death to be free, aren't you? Why would you give me advice? Stop asking foolish questions. Look carefully at how these coins shine. Yeah, shiny coins. If you wish to collect more of the treasure, stand over and press enter. I'm not doing that because in a previous uh, recording that I tried, uh, this goal, if you collect it, will kill you because that shade hates you. Okay, I'm just gonna skip over this gold. Uh, if you collect this gold and go down, it'll start poison. It's like poisoning you, and it's bad. Go back. Thou left your coins. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Thanks, anyway. I don't know if that's actually, uh, oh, hey, I can do, 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 do. I don't know if that's actually a speech option because I died before with this, or just because, I don't know. Continuing on down the dungeon. Oh, I should probably go to my map. Which is really cool. I like that a lot. Go back to the map. Oh, snake! It's enormous. Shit, that motherfucker's as tall as I am. Press space to attack. I don't have it binded to space, so. Ah! Yeah. Get some snake. Uh. Ooh, a chest. And where's the chest? There's his loot. Yes. I got a mace. Which has shit damage, but it's better against. Oh. 
it's better smashing weapon than it is cutting weapon. There's some barrels here. Looks like they've been here for a long time. They're rotten. That means that they're meant to be broken. Yeah, I'm trying to equip. There we go. And when I swing, it hits the barrels really good. The sword will not do that so easily. The sword takes a few hits because it's a cutting weapon, not a smashing. And I got 15 coins. So we'll go back to sword. Another snake. Let's make some snake steaks. Snake steaks. Snake steaks. That's, that was actually really good. Oh, more barrels. Ah. I haven't gone to recipes yet. Let's go on down. Whoa. Got a short bow. A light short bow. Ooh. A torch. Let's light it, because it's really dark in here. And that's a really cool aspect of the game, and it lights up the area. So you're not always just having this little bitty part of your screen. An oil lamp or something like that. I better light it too. Hope that jerk from Castlevania doesn't show up and start putting that with his whip. You and me both, buddy. You and me both. There we go. Hey, dark smoky dude, what's your name? I have no name. How's that work? The Lord of Castle has no name? You are mistaken. I am not the Lord of this castle. I am a shadow, and my task is to protect this place. You're just a minion? One of those one hit point wonders? If I had a pinch of an immense power, my lord, I could destroy you just like that. Snaps fingers. Well, shadow guy, this castle and your master are figments in my imagination. Let's say that I am the great creator of everything, and in a while everything will disappear, then no one will have to be destroyed just like that. Snap fingers. You, a pathetic creature of meat and bone, the creator of everything? Ha <laughs> Are you a liar or a fool? Whatever. I'm gonna give you a name. Names mean nothing to me. Let's see. What about Zeratul? The name of the Dark Templar in StarCraft. Do not dare call me that. As you wish, Zeratul. By the way, I haven't introduced myself. I care not. I'm known as Strider. My real name is Aragorn. Son of Arathorn, and I am the rightful heir to the kingdom of Gondor. Damn, I am trapped in the body of a fool! Are you calling me foolish? Who's more foolish, the fool or the fool who follows him? <laughs> this is actually. I love the uh, back and forth in this game. It's great. God, the, the dialogue was pretty good. Even if they had no voice actors. This one lights up the most. Potion of minor health. Yeah. Let's switch back to two. Get them arrows. Get them arrows! Yeah. Jumping, jumping puzzles. Blah. Some more short arrows. Back to one. I'm not sure what that really does. But it's cool. Cool. So, continuing on, more torches. Crouch near an edge to illuminate the area below. That would suck to jump on. Oh, balls. As I do it, anyways. Son of a bitch. I centipedes and I get health. Awesome. More health. Two let's smash them in these barrels. Barrel smashing. It's barrel smashing good. I don't even know what this thing is. I got floating spike ball. I can kill it, so let's go ahead and kill it. Some health. Yeah. Did I get that chest? I didn't get that chest. What am I doing? Loot! In reference to assign a shortcut to healing potions. Uh oh. Five bucks uh says that had a healing potion in it. Yep. And let's go to inventory. And I can put it here. No, I want it in this one. That works. Quit inventory. 
the best thing I like, one of the things I like about this game is that you actually get new equipment all the time. Ow, fuck. That was exactly what I was trying to avoid. So why don't I have my sword out? As in, I can't, uh, or I can equip new armor later on in the game once I get it. And they do have, like, shops and potions, and, uh, it is like an old-style RPG, and it's really good, actually. Um... I think I have a few more minutes. Let's see if I can't get to that door down, that cool looking door down there. Why didn't that hurt it? Shenanigans. Uh, and then I'm gonna stop for the day. Actually, it's just used to cast spells and create potions. It's a good idea to keep them for later. I don't have any spells or potions. Let's head up. I don't have a key for that. Let's head over here. I don't know if that's a thing. I actually got to here before and just don't know where quite where to go from here. I'll light up this area and that probably will be it because I don't have any keys. I need a key to open that. And I think that's what these are. Um, or I could Gods of Goball. What is this thing? It's a magical prison. Within lies one of the pure spirits of Harnakon. There's a spirit locked in that box. What, like a rival god? You are mistaken, Fates. Immortal. The spirit within is under the command of the Great Master. Really? Why is it locked up? It's pure spirit. It cannot exist in this plane. The box isolates and protects it. However, it can communicate through the vein. Beam of light. Well, must be an important guy. What's he do? I will not reveal that information. No? Okay. I'll ask him myself. You! Haha, <laughs> foolish mortal. He'll never talk to an insignificant slug like you. Really? We'll see. I love how arrogant this guy is. He's freaking amazing. This is kind of sweet. In Taro Adun. Who is it? Can't you tell? I possess his body to carry out an important mission for my great lord, Harnikin. You filthy liar! Anakin Bash, it's been a long time. What is this body you've taken? I haven't seen a being like this. This body I've taken belongs to a privileged race, the humans. In that case, I shall restore the vessel's vitality and remove any afflictions from it. Thank you. My great lord will be pleased with your assistance. I shall return if I need healing. For something else, my great lord has given me a new name from now on. I shall be known as Zeratul. It will be as you say, Zeratul. <laughs> as long as I can get here, I'll be safe. Press enter in front of the cage to save the gamer from your health. Your health has been restored. Game saved. Cool. That was kind of amazing. <laughs> okay. Um, I forgot what I really needed to do. Did you hear Zeratul? I've guaranteed Helly It's amazing. If I get hurt and get back here, I'm renewed. Just like re resting in the end of Dragon Warrior. I'll just have not to die before getting back here. Thou art back, Grog, and rogue for supplementing me. A better man would show his titles and name with pride. Yeah, yeah, sure. I'm not big on ceremony. So let's name this place Healing. And with that, uh, I think my time is just about up. So this was an epic adventure with Braxton. Let's, uh,. I'll probably do a few more of these videos. I'll talk to you guys later. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the game.